In the suburb of Brno, a city of 400,000 people, is the location of the new Wesleyan Ministry Center, or MIAC, in the town of Lesna. Lesna is uh, one of several major suburban areas of the city of Brno, a city of 400,000 people. Lesna has 40,000 of that number and not one single church. And we are excited that God has put us right in the heart of that community where we will be able to serve them with the gospel message. I'm standing in front of a building of almost 20,000 square feet of available space. Space that will be used for classrooms to teach English, theological education, including will be all of our office space, uh, a worship center that will seat 200, fellowship hall, all of that within the buildings itself. One of the aspects of our ministry here in the Czech Republic is sports ministry. And God blessed us with property that we were able to develop with sporting facilities. Presently, we're standing on a regulation-sized basketball court. In fact, in just a few days, the goals will go up and soon the lines will go on and we will have a basketball court. And with our ministries that we are doing, not all of it is on this property as we have a football team that we coach and, and we do other basketball ministry throughout the city. But this gives us an opportunity to bring people onto our property where we can control the, the environment and the atmosphere and be able to influence them in a more dynamic way. In order to complete this project, it's going to take a lot of bricks. It's going to take a lot of work. God blessed us. Really a miracle that we are standing on this property today. This property was not for sale. God opened it up and the man who owned it agreed to sell it to us when it wasn't even on the market. And so in doing so, he sold it for about one third, a little over one third of its market value. God is the one who is overseeing this project. It's his project. He gave us the property. He gave us the people to minister to. And I believe he's going to give us the resources to make sure that that happens. There are literally thousands of people right around us right now who we need to share the gospel of Jesus Christ with. And we thank him for this venue that he has given us to do that.